ARVA is an ARPA-E Smart Farm awardee. We manage six eddy covariance towers measuring methane and nitrogen, nitrous oxide emissions in rice and corn systems. The goal of that is to collect the data to validate our, our net negative uh, agriculture environment. So our lead scientist, Dr. Michael Schupenauer on this, a skeptic uh, about whether or not agriculture is, our, is an emitter, already believes we're net negative in terms of carbon and our whole ag ecosystem. And that when we take that as a starting premise, if we can prove that with data, then agriculture becomes a really different uh, uh, system now to start looking at large-scale carbon sequestration. So we just make incremental improvements to something that's already uh, has the potential to sequester a lot of carbon. That's where we're really going. So what we're doing today is our platform's up and running. We have what's called carbon ready. So with just field boundaries, we pull in all, lots of other data um, from satellites, soil data sets, crop data sets, USDA, et cetera. And we can help farmers start to understand what are we playing for in terms of carbon. So if you wanted to take your field, load it up in our platform, we can come back and tell you guys, here's what you're playing for. You're looking at on these fields, one to two tons of carbon, in some cases more per year. And now you can start to say, is that worth it to me? What is the price of that carbon? Is $20 enough if I can do two tons a year is that enough for me to sell to that? And our view is we want to help you get ready, carbon ready. What data do we need to move into actually originating the carbon? And once you originate that carbon, you choose when to sell it. You don't have to sell today. You can bank that credit just like we have a grain bin here. We can hold that until the market's ready. Those don't expire, but that carbon we can hold and trade and, and until the market gets to where we want it to be. So we'll be farming for yield and carbon in the near future.